Welcome back to another episode of Balling With, guys. Uh, we're still going down a lot and list of teams here. Uh, New Orleans Saints is next on the list. Uh, and they are a surprising team, interesting team to me this season. I think they had the tangibles to do pretty well. They're going to win their division in my eyes. Derek Carr, to me, the quarterback that can uh, probably, this is the best quarterback they had since Drew Brees. Uh, they still got the weapons on the outside. And they haven't won in 10 games, so they haven't gone up there, up there to win those uh, games. So they're not being stepped on. They are actually about the hype, as according to the book. So let's see what they're talking about. Uh, I do think they're going to win week one versus the Titans. It's going to be a tough game, but I think the Saints come off hot. I think Titans have a lot of um, stuff going on with the quarterback room. Um, that doesn't play well. It depends if Ryan Tannehill is healthy, but then you have Willis and Will Levis. And, but you still have Derrick Henry and Hawkins so, and a good defense, so I wouldn't put it past them, but Saints are going to move the ball as well. Uh, I do think they're going to do our, start, o and, start off 2-0 and o with the Panthers win here. Um, the New York, not the New York Giants, the Packers. Um, I'd see the Packers um, losing this game as well. So the Saints are starting off 3-0, 4-0 versus the Bucks. They're not going to lose that game. Uh, and they're not going to lose versus the Patriots. That's 5-0. I can see the Saints coming off to a really good start. 6-0 with the Texans. Um, tough matchup will be the Titans with week one. If they lose that, they're going to come back hot and win five in a row. So they're going to be 5-1. Or six and zero by week seven. Um, Jaguars are going to lose this game to the Saints. Are going to lose this game to the Jaguars. Um, that's going to be their first or second loss of the season. They're going to beat the Colts. They're going to beat the Bears. Uh, they're going to beat the Vikings. But it depends how the Vikings are playing. And I think Vikings will have this upper hand. Let's just say Vikings on this one. Saints will have lost one to two matches at this point in time. Uh, I think they're going to beat the Falcons. Uh, I think they're going to beat the Lions. It's going to be a tough matchup, but let's see if the Lions can come back. Depending on how they are in the division as well, going to be a tough division race. I was just looking at their list of their schedule earlier. Uh, I think the Saints will lose this game. So let's say Saints lose three games here in the loss to the Vikings, the Lions, the Jags. So far, they had a pretty good, easy start to the schedule. I do think they're going to beat the Titans. Uh, if they do lose to Titans, that's four losses at this point in December. But uh, I think they're going to have three losses by this point. The defense of the Saints is going to be pretty good. They're going to be back. You know, they're going to be they're going to be ready. They're going to win this game versus the Panthers again. They're going to beat the Giants. That is, uh, they're going to beat the Rams, beat the Bucks, and beat the Falcons. The Saints can be a thirteen and three win team, bro. And I'm still debating about any team going to win more than that. But it is going to be a few. Uh, and then the Saints are one of the teams that's up there that can win that many games up there with the – well, who was it I said? The Jaguars and I think the Dolphins have chances to win those 13 games, man. Uh, the Saints definitely are, have a chance. They have an easy beginning part of the schedule. Derek Carr is going to come in hot, new team. He's going to go to love in New Orleans. It's going to be his new team. He's going to retire with the Saints. He's going to like the Saints more than the Raiders in his career. Um, but, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I have the Saints going over 10 wins. Uh, easy. Um, just literally it's off the schedule. And the talent that they have on the team. Uh, who else was the other team we said that could be win that many games? Yeah, I think it was the no, Chargers and Jags. Both teams, Chargers, Jags, and Saints right now had a chance to win 13 games. Just looking at these schedules. Just saying something. But uh, catch you guys on the next one. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. We're going to get um, you know, more news, videos, highlights, challenges, sports bets. We're going to do in the local community with high school football games, highlights for the athletes, um, football and basketball. Guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, catch that journey, and follow it. And see you guys on the next video.